Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today is Tuesday and I have church later this evening. I was planning on doing a get ready with me but um, I didn't really have time because I have a lot to do today before church uh, so I just had to rush around and get ready but I did want to sit down, well not sit down, actually be standing up, but I wanted to film an outfit of the day for you um, and I'll just start with my jewelry. Uh, these earrings are uh, Betsy Johnson and they're just little skulls with uh, crowns on them. Uh, my mom actually got these for me for Christmas and then I have the matching bracelet and it just has the little uh, rhinestone or whatever you want to call that, uh, skulls on it. Uh, this necklace, I actually don't know where I got it, but this is actually my favorite necklace I have. It goes with 99% of my wardrobe. It's definitely my most worn necklace and it's got like diamonds on this side uh, but then it has like this little buckle and then on this side it just has studs so there's multiple ways you can wear it you can wear it diamonds on one side studs on the other or the buckle in front or however you want to do it I usually do the rhinestones in front uh, and the buckle on the side uh, and then I have this matching bracelet that came with it and it just has the little diamonds and it's like strappy uh, like I said, I don't know where I got this. I wish I did, uh, but I don't. Uh, but yeah, now I'm going to readjust my camera and I'll stand up and show you what I'm wearing. Okay, so this top, actually, I distressed myself. It was just a plain black t-shirt that I got at a thrift store uh, in the town where I live. I'm actually going to make a video. I'm sorry if you can't see me. I don't have uh, my tripod uh, so I'm having to just set my camera up weird, so it may not be a very good angle, but I'm going to get that fixed and I'm going to get me a tripod. But anyway, I have a thrift store in town where on Wednesdays, everything is 25 cents, and I always go and pick up t-shirts, and this was just an oversized black t-shirt that I distressed. Uh, I'm actually getting ready to make a video. Tomorrow is Wednesday. I don't know when this video will go up, but today is Tuesday. So tomorrow, I will be going thrifting, and I'm going to film that and show you the whole process of how I DIY t-shirts, distress t-shirts. But anyway, uh, this is just a black t-shirt, and you can see it has some holes in it, uh, some bleach splatter marks. I cut a V into it, cut it into like a tank top, and then it's longer in the back, and all this is faded and bleached. And then I just have a, a nude cami underneath. I got this at Walmart, I think. I'm not sure what the brand is. Uh, now I have to try to readjust so you can see my bottoms. <laughs> okay, so my bottoms are just these Faded Glory uh, camo leggings. At least they're supposed to be leggings. They're a little bit thicker, and they kind of have like a rougher feel to it, almost like jeans. But they're just leggings, and then I'm just wearing these work boot style booties that I got from Charlotte Russe. Actually, my dad got these for me, uh, but yeah, so there's the outfit. But like I said, I'm going to show you all how I distress t-shirts. This is just one of many that I have. I've been really into distressing lately. I haven't got to wear a lot of them because the weather's been really cold here, but it's really warm today, so I wanted to wear one, um, but I have a lot of distress t-shirts ready to wear for when the weather warms up. I love just raggedy looking t-shirts with like some leather pants or just holy jeans or just whatever. I think it's really cute. It's kind of my style. As you can tell, I'm kind of got a more edgy style even when it comes to my hair, which I didn't do anything with my hair today. I just um, blow dried it and I have a natural curl in my hair, so it kind of just did its own thing. I'm actually getting ready to get it cut next Tuesday. Um, I have an appointment and I think I'm actually going to have like a design put in the back of it. I'm not sure. I think I'm going to actually try to have that filmed if I can. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this short uh, outfit of the day. I think I might actually get my little boy's outfit today too. But um, if you're interested in this makeup look, um, go onto my Instagram. I'm going to have some pictures and I will list everything that I'm wearing down below. Um, it was just really simple and easy, but like I said, I'll have everything that I'm wearing listed down below. And my Instagram, my Instagram is Hopi D Beauty, just like it is here. And I have it linked in the description box. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this, and I will talk to y'all soon. Bye. Okay, so here's Gage. He won't sit still long enough for me to get a good outfit. Uh, but he is wearing a DIY onesie that I did myself, and it says, Y'all Need Jesus on it. <laughs> And he is wearing a little camo button up and nautica jeans and his boots don't fit him anymore. I had them picked out but they didn't fit so we're just going with socks today. Uh, but I tried
tried to match us a little bit. I do that every once in a while when I can. And his uh, little uh, shirt has orange and I don't see if you can tell. I mean, I don't know if you can tell. See, he's got some orange, the threading, so it matches his little onesie. But there him he is, looking adorable. Say bye, Bubby. He does not want to sit still. And there he goes. Okay, so this is our outfit. Uh, he won't sit still long enough for me to get him good. But I hope y'all enjoyed. I love you guys, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.